Well, the first thing you want to do when you're coming up to the furnace board to inspect it, you want to see if your furnace board is getting voltage. So here, when you look through the sight glass, I do see that my LED light is flashing. So this at least indicates to me that I am getting low voltage to my furnace board. Here we remove the panel. Just remember, right now we have 120 volts coming from our circuit breaker. I do have power energizing my furnace board. Here, this is your safety switch. Once you remove the panel, the safety switch will disengage and it will remove any power to your furnace board. So we're going to have to manually push this in while we're testing our furnace board. If you have electrical tape, just put electrical tape around it. So you can see here the board is off, the LED light is not on. I'm going to manually engage the switch. And you can see there that I do have voltage going to my furnace board. Point, I'm going to test the transformer. So here you have the red and the blue leads coming to your furnace board right here. So I should get a reading of 24 volts coming from my transformer. So we're going to pull these wires. We're going to put our multimeters inside the leads and see if we do have voltage. These are my low voltage wires coming off of my transformer. And here I have my leads inside and I do have 26 volts. So I am getting low voltage from my transformer. See here right now my board is not flashing. That's because I removed the 24 volts coming from my transformer. So here we're going to plug in our leads. I put one in right here already. We're going to put the second lead. As soon as I tie this in, I should get power to my, my board. As you can see there, my board does have the necessary voltage. So if you came up here and you saw that your board, um, the LED light was not flashing, Obviously, you would check the 120 volts coming in. You would check your circuit breaker. But if you didn't have power here to your board, that would indicate that you have a bad or faulty transformer. So right now, as far as testing my transformer, uh, everything seems to check out. I want to check the 120 volts coming in just to make sure we have the proper voltage. Here we have two wires coming off of our transformer. You have your black uh and you have your white, that's your neutral. You wanna trace those wires to the board and then we're gonna test the board for 120 volts. Here, right in the back, that's my black wire coming from my transformer and then my neutrals over here where the other neutrals are tied in. Here, I'm testing my board and I'm putting my multimeter on the terminals where my transformer was plugged in. And I'm just taking a voltage reading here and I do have a reading of 118 volts. So I do know at least I do have low voltage at my transformer energizing the board. And I do have 120 volts at my board. So we're going to plug those wires back into our board that we disconnected from our transformer. 